Speaker, would it be in order for a minister to attend the House and give a statement as to why it is there is no one authority with responsibility for the safety of rivers and canals? Uh, last night, my 12-year-old constituent, Owen Jenkins, died. He drowned at Beeston Weir. It appears that he went into the River Trent to assist another youngster who had got into difficulty in the water. Uh, Mr Speaker, it looks like this was an act of great courage and great bravery from a remarkable uh, young man, and I'm sure the whole House would join me in sending our heartfelt condolences to his family, his friends and all the other pupils at Chilwell School. Mr Speaker, summer is here. The schools are now breaking up for the summer holidays, and yet rivers, canals, quarries, ponds, lakes are all dangerous places, potentially, especially for children and youngsters. But there's no one authority that has responsibility for safety. I think a minister should come along and explain how can we, can, we can make sure that all those places are safe for all of us, especially young people. Well, I'm very grateful to the Right Honourable Lady for her point of order and for her courtesy in giving me advance notice of her intention to raise it. She's paid warm and eloquent tribute to young Owen Jenkins, to whom, as she rightly says, and I'm sure she speaks for all of us, we wish to send to all of his friends and family our deepest condolences, and we want to remember the very remarkable courage that he showed. I'm not aware of any intention on the part of a minister to come to the House to make a statement on the matter, but the Right Honourable Lady asked whether it would be in order for a minister to do so. It certainly would. And we still have several sitting days, and I think if a minister were to come to the House to make a statement on that matter, to explain the delineation of functions or allocation of responsibility and to answer questions about the matter, that would be very well received by the House, and I dare say it would be very well received by the family of young Owen Jenkins. Thank you.